monument dedicated to the legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. in Concord vandalized. Police are looking for the person or group they say spray painted across the face of the large granite monument. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Molly Grantham in for Siobhan Bryan. And I'm John Carter. The city has now cleaned the monument, but some say the hurt caused by this act remains. WBTV's David Wisnett live in Concord right now where that monument is located. So David, do police know who did this or why? Well, Molly, police tell me just within the last hour they do not know who is responsible and they're not really sure about the motive for defacing this monument that you see behind me. Now, a lot of folks in the community have some ideas about that motive, but they also tell me whether this was racially motivated or just an act of vandalism, it is hurtful. Work crews wrapped up pressure washing the monument this morning, washing away the spray paint that defaced this large monument that former Mayor Scott Padgett says is a point of pride for the city. Very much, very much. You know our uh, yard, our street signs point to Martin Luther King monument. He was there for the monument's dedication in 2009 after a big effort from the community to have it built here. Coming back today to talk about it being defaced is sad, Paget says. It made me sad, uh, very sad, uh, because I know what went on to build it. Police say the vandalism happened on Saturday night. Most neighbors didn't see the damage, but did notice the monument covered up on Sunday. When I come by, I got a look and it was covered up. I had no idea what was going on. I would probably come to expect certain things like that in today's society because um, there's just a lack of love a lack of empathy and compassion. Folks I spoke with in Concord today are disappointed that such an act would be committed and they're hoping for justice. Things like that are bound to happen when our society is, you know, just devoid of all the things that make us coexist without, you know, hating each other for skin color. Well, I think somebody ought to take responsibility for it and take what they deserve. I mean, they got no business messing up with that. And the current mayor of Concord, Bill Dush, sent me a statement where he said that this monument that you see behind me, he says that's a symbol of hope and justice and the desecration of this cherished memorial has no place in our city. Reporting live in Concord, David Wisnett, WBTV, on your side. Well said, David. Thank you.